Hello, welcome back to another Trailer Tuesday. I am your host, me. <laughs> For those of you who are new, every Tuesday I put out a video called Trailer Tuesday where I react to some new trailers that have been released. I give my rating, sometimes I give a little blurb. We're just gonna jump right in. Cue intro. I've got six trailers for you this week, so let's just jump right in. The first one I'm going to be watching is for The Witcher. It is officially the like official official trailer. It's the second one that they've released. The first one was like a teaser, so gotta get my glackies on. Move hair. I've heard tales of your kind, Witcher. <laughs> You're a mutant, created by magic, roaming the continent. We don't want your kind here. Hunting monsters. Oh, that looks For fun. Price. I thought you'd have fangs or horns or something. I had them filed down. <laughs> People call you a monster too. Why not kill them? Because then I am what they say I am. All of our choices draw our destinies closer. If he is out there, there is still hope. I have to find Geralt of Rivia. Don't judge me. They say witches can't feel human emotion. What do you believe in? Evil is evil. Lesser. Greater. Middling. It's all the same. Princess Cirilla is your own destiny. Protect her. If you dismiss it, yes! you will unleash true calamity upon us all. I'll take that chance. Well, that was a fun face. Accepted. I like it. That looks like fun. Given that, 8 out of 10. I like Miss Henry Cavill. I like the style of these kind of films. You know I like my war stuff. But I love sword fighting and monsters and creatures and magic and I love... It's just like, yes. Alright, the next trailer I'm going to be watching. I didn't even know this was going to be a thing, so I'm kind of excited for it. It's a Christmas Carol. Another one. <laughs> BBC Tonight, again. You will not see. Oh. Come and look upon the evil that Ew, you did. Guy Pierce. He looks fun. Oh, yeah. The ghost of me. What do you want? To inspect your heart. And so, justice will grab you by the throat and drag you to the truth. I don't care for riddles. This is not a game. Ah! Ebenezer Scrooge. I don't know. I don't know how I feel about it. That one is gonna be about a five, I think. Just because they've done so many of them. It says it has Tom Hardy in it, but like, it's Andy Serkis. So I don't, I don't know where Tom Hardy is in this, because I didn't see Tom Hardy once in this trailer. So false advertisement, five out of 10, because it, especially with that last thing with like the sewn up mouth. Is that supposed to be the ghost of Christmas yet to come? 
Because you're not supposed to see his face. It's supposed to be, like, death. And that doesn't look death. That doesn't look like a scare. So, unimpressed, bitch. All right. I have low hopes for this. This next one is called Servant. It is a horror series that's going to be done by M. Night Shyamalan. He's very hit or miss. Mainly miss. You know that is a terrifying pretend home. child. Brienne? Brienne Grayson? Hello, Mrs. Turner. Hi, I'm Sean. Pleased nice to meet you, Mr. Turner. Apple original? What? Home. She is a godsend. I was expecting someone older, less weird. We hope you'll treat our house as your home. I'm sure you and Jericho will form an instant bond. Jericho? She's cool with everything. She knows the situation. Ripper grin. Oh, love. What? I guess we should talk about this. She's gone. You can put the doll down now. I'm fine as I am, Mr. Turner. We lost Jericho when he was 13 weeks. Dorothy took it hard. Okay. This is the only thing that brought her back. I should take Jericho for his walk now. We hired a nanny for a doll. <laughs> Where did you find her? She is wonderful with Jericho. And if my baby trusts her, so do I. How much did those boys tell you about what happened? What if she wakes up? What if she remembers? What? I don't know. That one I'm gonna give seven out of 10. And only because, A, Rupert Grint, cause he's everything. B, it's very, it's giving me like a creepy vibe and it's giving me the same vibes that Split gave me. And that gave me creepy vibes and that made me wanna see it. So this is giving me very equal creepy vibes. Seven out of 10, I'm definitely seeing this. When it comes out, somehow, I don't have Apple Plus TV, whatever but I will eventually somehow magically get to watch this. Also, I'm just forewarning you now, there m probably won't be movie reviews for the next couple weeks because the theater in my hometown sucks and doesn't have them, so I'm mad. The only way I'll be able to actually do like other ones is if like I'll, I have it like a day late. So if you don't mind it being posted on a Saturday instead of the Friday for the next two weeks, then okay, I will do that for you still. But uh, yeah, the next one I'm going to be watching is not looking forward to it really. It's an animated movie called Scoob. So it's Scooby-Doo, animated, brand new. We'll see. Oh, oh, it's about to start. You ready? Ready. Popcorn? Butter. Nachos? Cheese. Root beer with red licorice straw? Right here. <laughs> Maybe it's time we made our new movie. Good idea, Scoob. But first we need a trailer. Oh, oh, can you do the trailer guy voice? Hmm, well, let me give it a shot. <laughs> In a world destroyed by evil. Discover the epic origin story of the greatest team of heroes. In the history of mystery. <laughs> Not bad. Nailed it. Too bad you didn't nail Shaggy's voice. Ah! Oh. Hey! Oh. This mangy stray is coming with me. He's not a stray. Okay, then. What's his name? His name's Scooby. Middle name? Doobie? Last name? Do. <laughs> <laughs> you said that Stupid. we would always be. Without you, I feel lost at sea. I love it. The darkness I'll never take it off. 
Ew. Uh, maybe don't do that again. I'm Fred. This is Velma. Hi. And that's Daphne. Hey. I'm Shaggy. And this is Scooby Doo. Nice to meet you. Trick or treat. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Shaggy and Scooby were taken? Uh -huh. Do you Ew. realize where we are? No. Look around, man. The clean, modern aesthetic, the cool blue color palette. We're in Ikea. the Falcon Fury. Did you say Ikea? Nope, I said Falcon Fury, just like you. Maybe this can lead us to Scooby and Shaggy. Trace amounts of mustache oil, 12-year-old scotch. Ugh, is the bad guy my dad? <laughs> Ew. Yeah, I giggled a couple times, okay? Some of the jokes are funny, and I hated those robots. I don't like Shaggy's voice. It's not Shaggy enough. No one will ever trump Matthew Lillard's version of Shaggy. I'm sorry, but he sounded exactly like him. It was perfect. This is about a 6 out of 10. It doesn't look great. It doesn't look horrible. I'll, I might see it. I might not. I haven't decided yet. 6 out of 10. All right. Another trailer here is for a horror movie called Fantasy Island. Let's do this, bitch. I hope you're ready. Fine. There is an elevator. In the elevator, you, see hail? you press the button to the floor with no name. Slytherin. Behind those doors, there's a life. You always dreamt of. Oh, it's Blumhouse Productions. That's where I brought her. This is giving me perfect Hi. getaway vibes. It's here. This weekend, you will be our guests. Here, anything and everything is possible. No service. It's not everything is possible. Good evening. I'm Mr. Rurik. Let me officially welcome you to... Fantasy Island. Fantasy Island! I'm curious how this all works. What if your fantasy involves a person from your life? Holograms, like Tupac. What if it's somebody who died? Tupac. <laughs> so, what's your fantasy? Revenge on a childhood bully. Just got it. I see it. Your life is about to change. Got it. Yeah, I want it. I hope you're ready. Who is she? What are you doing? Uh, that is a really good hologram. There is only one fantasy per guest. And you must see your fantasy through. It brought her back to life. <laughs> no matter what. Oh my god. That's really her. Work. This is not what I meant. What the hell is this place? We'll die here. No! The island's twisting what we asked for. We weren't brought here to have our own fantasies. I want it. I got it. I want it. We were brought here to be a part of someone else. I got it. I want it. I got it. I'm your friend. I've always wanted to hear you say that. <laughs> Six out of ten. I didn't like that they used an Ariana song as their horror theme, because... What? <laughs> you have a plethora of music out in the world. Why are you using Seven Rings as your horror movie song? That makes no sense. Intriguing premise. Doesn't look that scary. Then again, it is anything with... Michael Pena... 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 Michael... <laughs> really that scary? No, it's not. I may watch it, I may not. The final trailer of today's video is gonna be a wonderful one. I'm hoping, I'm hoping it's a wonderful one because I live for these. If you've never seen Shane Dawson doing a like, conspiracy theory video in the past, 
uh, there was a, quite a few videos that he's done talking about the Mandela effect, where you specifically remember something being one way, and then when you look back, it's completely different. Like, for example, the Berenstain Bears. Everyone always thought it was Berenstain Bears, but it's actually Stain, like A-I-N instead of E-I-N. And there's just, there's a whole lot of things, like... Luke, I am your father is not Luke, I am your father. It's no, I am your father. Mirror, mirror on the wall is not that. It's magic mirror on the wall. So there's a little like blips that have happened over time. And I fully believe in the Mandela effect. I think it's a fully real thing. So now they've created a movie clearly based on it. So now I'm excited to see what it's all about. So let's watch. Sam, my precious Sam. Hey, Sam. Stay where we can see you. Becoming parents gave Claire and I a greater sense of purpose. Whoa. Every day brought with it new memories. Each one sacred in its own way. Oh, uh, dead. It doesn't feel real. I know exactly what you mean. Crazy. I saw her. You should think about talking to someone. Like a grief counselor. When Sam died, I began to notice these inconsistencies. Of course, Morgan Freeman is. Do you remember where this was taken? Yeah, it's Griffith Observatory. I swear, I remember taking this photograph. We were, but we were in Seattle. How would you feel if you could no longer trust your own memories? You remember the children's book when you were growing up about the family of bears? The Berenstein Bears. Berenstein. S-T-E-I-N. We've been hard to reach lately. I just started noticing some things. And... Like what kind of things? We're living in parallel universes. Can you picture the Monopoly man? Yeah. What's on his face? Monocle. Apparently, it's never been the case. The Mandela effect. Either we're sliding between parallel realities. Or like a simulation and it's glitching out. Do you hear yourself right now? Maybe it's in my head, Claire, but what if it's not? Maybe none of this is real. <laughs> Ew. Don't like that. What makes you think this is going to bring your daughter back anyway? I design games. I code. If this is a simulation, I mean, if this is code, then I can do something. It's no small thing shutting the world down. There's something you're going to need to understand. Ideas. It's not Morgan Freeman. <laughs> are dangerous things. Huh. Okay. Well, doesn't I don't know. I don't know how that one is to me. I'm going to say that's about a six as well. It's very just more Hollywoodized than the actual conspiracy of everything is. Again, I might see it just because I do enjoy Mandela effects and the theory behind them. I think they're fascinating. So that might be the only reason why I will go and see this movie. Just strictly based on that but like it doesn't look like it looks like it would be like probably a made for tv movie with like a higher budget that's about it anyways that is all the trailers that i have for you this week if you did enjoy watching me react to them make sure you give it a like if you liked any of the trailers in this make sure you give it a like if you disliked any of the trailers make sure you give it a like comment down below letting me know which trailers you liked which ones you hated which movies that you want to go out and see based off the trailers let me know what trailers you want me to react to for next week don't forget to share the video and don't forget to subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so that way you know when i put out a brand new video and i will see you maybe sometime this weekend for a movie review i want to go and see charlie's angels it's not playing in my hometown so i have to go to a different theater and if i'm going to do that it's going to have to be friday and up saturday so I'll probably see you on Saturday with a movie review for Charlie's Angels. Bye. My life is a party, my home is the club. I party like a rock star, dance until I drop.